Thanks. Thanks for coming in. Woo! Holy mackerel, there are so many people here in Bisbee. What is going on? Something about the turkey buzzards returning to Bisbee. Well, I'll tell you something else that's returned to Bisbee. It's pea berries. How many of you are waiting for pea berries? Hold up your hands. Yeah, pump fists, pump fists, pea berries. We've got Papua New Guinea. Let's go drink some. Woohoo! I hope I can get this in focus. You guys, you guys have been waiting so long for this. Check it out. Can you see that? That's the little green pea berries. Aren't they cute? They're so small. They're so cute. They're so cute. We're so lucky to get coffees like these. Nebler Valley coffees are sold out before the containers land in San Francisco. If I didn't know this coffee personally and contract for it in advance, we would never see these luscious little pea berries. There's an incredible caramel sweetness to the aroma of this coffee. Oh, such delicious candy. Floral like a florist shop. Floral like fresh snipped green stem, rose stem. I like this a lot. Grandma, woo-hoo, oh man. Ah, this coffee has a fantastic aroma of tobacco, leather, caramel. Mm. The body is smooth. That's that characteristic smooth Nebler Valley milling. The fact that it's a pea berry, well, that just makes it a tiny bit spicier and more complex. There's a touch of syrup, maple syrup, and graham crackers. Now the finish, the finish is still buttery and, and there's some honey, buttery honey pecan. That's just ridiculously good. Well, don't wait until the turkey buzzards come home to your town to order yourself some Nebler Valley pea berry from Papua New Guinea. I love you guys. Thanks for coming out to cup coffee with me, and I'll see you again next week. Mwah!